Hey y'all, Luck here from Fox 3, and I wanted to show you Skin in the Game FX. This is our newest application that will build uh, liveries for DCS. Currently, the only livery we have available is the F-18, but we are working on other livery uh, aircraft right now. So uh, eventually, we hope to have all the aircraft, including the non-flyable planes, so you can build your own skins for, say, an, an E-2 or a tanker or something like that. Okay, so with start off, we ask for the customer name. Um, <clears throat> this could be anybody, John Doe, for instance. And then we ask for the customer email address. So we're going to put an email address in here. I just happen to have a few f funny ones, so I'll just use Fox3. Okay, and then we're going to ask for the pilot name for the canopy. So this is where you get the name, uh, put the name next to your canopy, and we offer it in black or white text. So some cases black looks good, uh, some cases white looks good. So I'm just going to put um, Lieutenant, oops, if I could spell luck. Okay, and I'd like it in white. Next thing we're going to do is pick, pick the template. So I'm going to select the skin base that we're going to use, and we have several to choose from. Um, this is the blue, blue skin we call it, and um, you know we have Finland, we have various countries, we have Fox 3 Retro, I like this one too, I have one in that already. Uh, and then some of the ones that come with DCS uh, that we've used as bases. And there's also, like if you want the Royal Australian or the Royal Canadian or Span Spanish uh, skins, we have several Spanish skins. We'll be adding more and more to these. Uh, eventually, we'll like to see, you know, between 50 and 100. Here's a Swiss skin. I kind of like this tri-gray. It's a pretty looking, pretty good looking skin, so I'm going to select it. And uh, the next thing we're going to do is the wear level. So it can either be brand new with basically no wear, slightly worn, medium wear, or very worn. You know, if it's a National Guard plane, it's probably very worn. If it's seen a little combat, it's probably slightly or medium worn. I'm going to go with slight worn in this case. And the next thing I'm going to do is choose my nose art. So... Uh, the nose art should be a PNG file, and I have uh, this Lion PNG I like to put on here, and it gives me a warning. Uh, the nose art should be 5 to 4 or aspect 1.25 aspect ratio, um, and then there's some things in here to help you figure out which uh, ratios they should be and, and the number of pixels, or what could happen is the art could get a little distorted when we fit it on the aircraft, so keep that in mind. Um, the, the other thing is, we're down here, should the arm, uh, image be mirrored on either side? So if your image contains text, you definitely want to check this because um, instead of flipping it around so it's pointing the same direction, they both be pointing toward the nose. Uh, if you did that to something with text on it, then uh, the text becomes backwards. So you want to make sure that that's checked if you have text. Next one is the tail art. And um, let's see here. I kind of like the rooster. I'll throw that on there. And again, same goes for this one. If you want to check it, if you have t if you have uh, any kind of text on it, and that's that's really it for your options. So then you hit submit, and it's sent. So essentially, it, right now uh, the skin's being built. It takes 30 seconds, and then in your email, you'll receive an email. It could take you know less than five minutes, uh, with a link to your uh, skin to download. So I'm going to pause the video here, go grab my email, and I'll show you that. John Doe, F-18, try gray, and there's the numbers, uh, you know, the email address and all that good stuff. It's 48 meg, so I'm going to download. I'm going to save it. And now uh, I'll show you how it looks when we, I'm going to see the John Doe thing. Now, one of the things I'll do right now is extract it, and I'll show you guys how to install these. So we'll extract it all the way out. Here's the actual skin. Uh, for now, I'll just close it. And in the directory that it's in, here it is right here, it's John Doe. So what I'm going to do is just take all this out and just call it John Doe. Oops. That way, you can see what it looks like in game. So I just hit John Doe. Now that's what's going to be the skin in, John, in um, the game. So the next thing I'm going to do is open up my Save Games folder. 
and I'm going to open up uh, Fox Free Open Beta, or I'm sorry, DCS Open Beta, and then under Liveries, under the F18, and I have a whole bunch of stuff out there. But I'm going to take this John Doe and just drop it in here. So now when I fire up DCS, and DCS takes a while to fire up, so I'll pause here. All right back after five minutes of DCS starting, and it's still coming up. Uh, but once this comes up, I'll show you how it looks. All right, perfect timing. My system's no slouch either. I don't know why it's so slow lately. Okay, so I'm going to go to Instant Action just to show you this F-18 cold and dark. Na -na 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 -na. My machine's a Core i9, 13th gen, with uh, 64 gigs of RAM, and a NVIDIA 4080 with NVMe drives. No slouch. Anyway, here we go. I'm in the F-18, and let me hit my F-12 to fix all that. Okay, let's rearm it. Oopsie. All right, and we're going to look to the livery, and I'm going to get the one we just got, which is John Doe. Scrolling down here, John Doe. There we go. Oops, I missed it. Gosh. John Doe. Request rearming. F2. Now we can scroll Copy. in and see what was built. There's my rooster on the back. There's my Lieutenant Luck on the side. There's my lion in the front. Swing it around, and you can see the lion is... Now, this is what it looked like mirrored. Um, the line is facing the other way, so um, if that was had text on it, it would look normal. Uh, the, the rooster on the back is the same way, and we have uh, Lieutenant Luck on this side as well. The, the skin has some wear on it, you can see it, and it's uh, you know not perfect, Rearming but complete. it's lightly worn, and that is how it works. So you basically can get your skin in 30 seconds. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy it. There's going to be many more features coming out. We hope to have a, a preview uh, soon. We're going to be adding all the airplanes. Uh, I have six artists working on the airplanes right now, and the more we add, the better. Hopefully, it'll be to the point where we can do some other features like uh, squadrons uploading their own template, and then they can apply names to them and patches and whatever on, on their various uh, aircrafts. Anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed this and look for it uh, coming up soon. It's gonna be, we're gonna go live soon. Skin in the Game FX is the name of the application, and there'll be a link from the Fox3ms.com site. Thanks for watching.